food minister had to say he's announced a slew of sugar swaps. The import duty on sugar has been hiked to 40% from the current 15%. Export incentives have also been extended. However, these incentives will come with some riders. Hear them out. मिल मालिक के जो गन्ना किसान का ये ग्यारह हजार करोड़ रुपया बकाया है तो हम सारे इंसेंटिव्स क्या कहते हैं तभी क्या कहते हैं कि दिया जाएगा जबकि मिल मालिक इस बात की गारंटी लें कि किसान का जो बकाया है वो के ग्यारह हजार करोड़ वो पेमेंट क्या कहते हैं कि करेंगे और इसके लिए इस नहीं नहीं इसके लिए इसके लिए जो है हमारे जो सेक्रेटरी है फूड सेक्रेटरी है उनको कहा गया है कि आप जो गन्ना जो मिल मालिक हैं जो उनके प्रतिनिधि हैं या जो भी हैं उनको बुला करके आप बैठ कर बुलाइए और उनसे पहले इस बात का एक्सपीरियंस लीजिए All right, uh, Gorang has been tracking uh, that story and is here to take us through the details. Gorang, you know, we've seen three or four important things really coming out, whether it's far as, uh, you know, the export swaps. But one important thing, of course, is that the government is telling the millers that you clear the 11,000 odd crore dues to the farmers and only then will these uh, swaps, so to speak, be rolled out. Well, yes, indeed. Um, the minister has said, in fact, that um, an in-principle guarantee must come from these mill owners first before any of these four measures can be uh, really considered. In fact, uh, these four, four, the four-point plan was mooted today by the minister, and he has said, uh, like you said earlier, you know, the four, import duty will be hiked to 40 percent. Uh, the export subsidy for this year will be paid up till the month of September. And, uh, you know, some relief will be given to mill owners as well in terms of uh, loan terms being extended from three years to five years. Uh, and uh, additional 4,400 crore rupees of loans will also be given to them um, uh, for them to be able to clear their dues. But like you rightly said, the minister has p uh, placed that right of first initially saying that unless uh, the guarantee, an in-principle in guarantee comes from these uh, mill owners on, uh, on really these measures, and on the fact that these dues will be cleared. Up till then, none of these measures can be put into place. One last thing which was also uh, really pointed out and has been given in principle approval today in today's meeting uh, is, the, is the matter of ethanol blending. And in, in today's meeting, in fact, uh, the matter of 10% ethanol blending in fuels has been given a go ahead um, by these ministers. All right, so let's continue focusing on that story. Prana has been speaking to some of the sugar industry leaders for their take really on the reform measures which were announced earlier today. Prana, you know, a couple of things. Uh, there are, of course, your UP-based mill owners versus your uh, South India-based mill owners. A couple of them could benefit one section more than the other. And, of course, there's that rider of clearing the farmer's dues first. But what are you picking up? Well, definitely they feel that this is a step in the right direction by the new government. But, but of course, one key concern is that the alignment of prices of sugar and sugar cane, which needs to be al aligned. Remember, the Rangarajan committee too felt that the only uh, way to revive the sugar sector is to link sugar prices with sugar cane prices. Also, they feel that the prices of sugar should be allowed to go up by 5,000 rupees to 6,000 rupees per ton. Also, price of sugar and sugar cane needs to be allowance so this is one thing that they are really hoping for and as far as the ethanol blending is concerned they feel that more distilleries needed in the country for ethanol blending now remember as per the previous government's move of five percent ethanol blending which is not yet achieved because of problems over pricing and procurement the third thing is that the banks are hesitant to lend the sugar uh, sectors and remember out of the 6500 crores of interest fee, uh, fee loans that were approved in December last year, only 4,000 crore rupees has been disbursed by the bank so far. So these are the top, you know, key three issues that uh, needs to be addressed immediately by the new government for a long-term revival of the sugar sector.